We're following a number of other stories happening throughout the bluegrass. Tyler Melito is in the studio with your news now. Good morning, Tyler. Good morning, Krista. Kentuckians will soon have a chance to pay their respects to Virginia Moore. The 61 year old passed away Saturday following complications from heart surgery. She served as the main sign language interpreter for Governor Andy Bashir during his regular COVID-19 updates. A memorial is set for June 11th from 1 to 5 at the Muhammad Ali Center in Louisville, and it will be open to the public. A reminder that early voting starts today, so if you're headed to the polls, make sure you have valid forms of ID. The process of ensuring an election is fair and secure starts well before you get to cast your ballot. And speaking with Fayette County Clerk Susan Lamb, even before voting machines are sent to a precinct, they get inspected by members of the county's Board of Elections, making sure none of the security features on them have been tampered with. And as the weather starts to heat up, children and families are looking for a way to cool down. And the Woodland Aquatic Center has just what you need. Hoist your sails and drop ye anchors, matey, because the Woodland Aquatic Center is currently under construction on a new sunken pirate ship attraction known as Paradise Lagoon. The attraction is coming to Lexington this summer and is set to feature slides, water cannons, and a whole lot of high sea fun. That was your news now. Krista. Thank you, Tyler. I hope we're not too old to try out that Never pirate ship. Never. I love awesome. it. Yes, we'll go later when it's ready. Well, coming up.